what you did is probably the 11 year old Braden Smith knows his way around a baseball diamond. Oh, yeah. As a player for the Burlington Pirates, he's had some training swinging a bat, but he never thought that training would prove useful off the field. Friday morning, he was home alone when a stranger knocked on his front door. I was hiding behind my door. I didn't answer the door. Braden says a man then burst through the front door and found him in his room. When he came in the room, he pointed a gun at me and um, he told me to sit down on the ground and get in my closet. And I did that. The suspect went into the living room to gather electronics, then went back to question Braden. He found my phone on the counter and he took the phone, but he dropped it. And that's when I, I picked up my machete and hit him in the back of the head. Orange County deputies say the suspect, 19 year old Jatavion Hill, kicked Braden in the stomach. Braden swung the machete again, but missed. And if I didn't do anything about it, he could have taken me with him. He could have, he could have done anything. The sheriff's office says Hall dropped everything and ran, but was later arrested at a local hospital. And despite the frightening ordeal, Christopher Smith says his son only had one thing on his mind. And he was like, uh, am I still going to be able to play baseball? Can I get back into the house to get my uniform? So I was like, heck yeah, dude. We're going. Dad says he trained his son to expect the unexpected. My dad, he has taught me a lot of stuff, like to stay calm. But says a higher power also had a hand in his son's safety. I thank God, you know, he had a big part in it. You know, um, the Lord was looking out for him today. From swinging a machete to swinging a bat, all in a day's work for young Braden. In Mebbin, Tahitia Moyes, WFMY News 2.